That is cool. These are so sexy without the bumpers. Now, wait a minute here. Oh, that is a sick conversion. I like that. Who put the Studebaker nose on the Chevy? Um, two dogs. A friend of mine. Friend of yours? Yeah. That is great. He also post treated it. Yeah. It's on bags. Ah, Air okay. Bags. Nice. What's under the hood? 383 stroker. Very good. 450 horsepower, 450 foot pounds of torque. I got a Richmond 9 inch on the back with 456 gears. Jeez, this thing must fly. It goes pin there every place but it passes the gas station. Yeah. <laughs> oh, you got the uh, toilet flush uh, carburetor on there. You just flush the gas down. It, it just goes right through and out the side pipes. Yeah. Yeah. But damn, you look good doing it. But you, you know what a motor is, right? I know what an engine is, yes. yes. It's a big compressor. Yes. Yeah. So it sucks the air in and pushes it, pushes it out. All it does is suck in, push out. That's it. Yep. And if you can afford to run it, you run it. That's it. That's, that's it. it. By the way, that's an engine, not a motor. Oh, that's true. That's true. Because a motor has external uh, en energy. The uh, engine generates the energy. This one uh, sucks up the gas. Of course. Come on. Back in our day, I mean, we were pumping 25 cent gallon. I mean, if you got 20 miles per gallon, that was a Volkswagen Beetle. That was big uh, car mate. Well, I don't know. I'm just younger. Yeah. Well, uh, I'm only 39. Second time around the odometer, though. <laughs> My kids are 55. Ah. So... Oh, they're adopted, I know. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But uh, I'm enjoying it. Good. This is fantastic. Absolutely fantastic. I bring it out, not for the accolades or not for the award, mm -hmm. just for education. Yeah. No, people, so people can... Oh, this is a student break. Oh, no. Well, it says it. I said, <coughs> if I go shopping at... Shop right. And I put it in a King's bag and I come home. Are you convinced that I went shopping at King's? Uh, no. I said, well, you have to be careful what you assume all the time. Yes. Well, you remember what Oscar Madison said about assuming. Mm -hmm. So, that's it. But this is what custom is all about having fun. But uh, it did take a lot of work. And, uh, Unfortunately, my, my friend Two Dogs passed uh, before he had emphysema really bad. Mm. But the week before he died, he was out driving this as fast as he could go with his oxygen bottle and his mask sitting right beside him. But, uh, <clears throat> and uh, tribute to him, I tell everybody his story. Uh, how he got it and where he, where he put it all together. Yeah. And uh, where did he get it and how did he put it together? We we bought three vehicles and an, uh, an engine. The '51 Chevy came from Houston, Texas, on a flatbed to my house in Jersey. Then from Jersey went back to Katy, Texas, and got the '50 Champion Studebaker. Mm -hmm. And then up near Toronto where he lives, he got a uh, sh short base uh, Chevy uh, pickup, an S10, and we uh, started chopping. We ended up with parts over there, parts over here, parts over here, but he uh, got it all together, and of course, he didn't care what underneath the hood looked like or anywhere, he just wanted to paint the outside pretty and then everybody stopped and see him. So he's probably looking down today saying, he 
got it out in the rain again. I said, well, you know, that's... Hey, that's, come on. That's the way it is. That's it. This is great. Well, I appreciate you. Okay. Oh, thank you. Wow. Yeah, I wish the sunshine would come through to see this metallic, this pearlescent. Yeah, pearl, pearl paint, and it's got a satin finish, so that it, it'll pop in the sun, but it's not really uh, yeah. grotesque. Yeah, it's not well, popping this is, in. This uh, a 20-year-old paint on it, too. So. Really? You guys did good with it, with it then. All right. All right. This is beautiful. Wow. Well, I have everything I think I'll need if I get stranded. Yeah. Clothes, food, tools. Because I'm driving 160 miles each way, or like round trip every day to get here. So. Jeez. Unreal. And my wife said to me, why would you do that? Why didn't you stay? Yeah. I said, well, part of the experience is driving. True. The driving experience. So you drive back and forth. Uh, it gets a little hairy on the weekends because people are crazy. Yeah. It worked out very good. Good. This is wonderful. What's your first name? First name is Cliff. Cliff? Yeah. Very good, Cliff. I'm Pam. Thank you. Okay. Be careful where you don't fall down there. Thank you. Thank you for stopping. Oh, gosh. This is great. Here's to you two, dog. And Cliff. We put together this Chevy Baker that is sweet that is sweet this is what hot rodding is all about folks for more cool events like this and unusual cars like this make sure you check your car show calendars northeastwheelsevents.com southeastwheelsevents.com ukwheelsevents.com and while you're there post and share your events I'll see you at the show